Hello, I'm Stacy. Thanks for visiting Toastmasters International, where more than 4 million people have become more confident speakers and leaders. They did so by visiting a Toastmasters club in their company or community. When you visit a club, you'll find three things. Members give speeches, they take on meeting roles, and they have a great time learning. There is no designated teacher in a Toastmasters meeting. Instead, much of the learning happens by doing a particular task, such as giving a formal speech or fulfilling a particular meeting role. Ready to visit a club? It's free. And you can find one near you on the Toastmasters website at www.toastmasters.org. The purpose of the meeting roles is to help the members improve their speaking and leadership skills by providing feedback and evaluation. There are seven different meeting roles. Toastmaster of the Day, Awe Counter, Grammarian, Timer, Evaluator, Table Topics Master, and General Evaluator. Every meeting is started by the club president who introduces the Toastmaster of the Day. The Toastmaster of the Day is the host of the meeting. Fulfilling this role is great practice for leading meetings. The Toastmaster begins by introducing people who will fill other meeting roles for the day. He or she acts like an MC and keeps the meeting flowing smoothly and on time. Many clubs use an awe counter to document the number of filler words members use while speaking. At the end of each meeting, the awe counter reports how many ahs, ums, and other similar words each speaker used. This helps members become more aware of unintended words or sounds they make when they speak. The grammarian helps members expand their vocabularies. One of the grammarian's duties is to provide a word of the day and its definition. If a member uses the word of the day or says something well, the grammarian calls attention to it. As the name implies, the timer records the exact length of each speech. He or she also uses timing lights to help speakers stay within their allocated time limits. The general evaluator takes notes throughout the meeting and reports back to everyone, giving specific feedback on how well the meeting flowed and also on how future meetings might be improved. The general evaluator also calls for reports by the awe counter, grammarian, and timer. In every club meeting, there are at least two members who present speeches. These speakers don't just stand up and start talking. They use the guidelines in their designated education manuals to prepare their presentations and reach the objectives for each speech. Every speaker who has prepared speeches in advance enjoys one of Toastmasters' greatest benefits, evaluation. Think of it as having a friend watch you practice a speech and then give you helpful feedback. The speaker usually meets with an evaluator before the meeting and asks the evaluator to pay attention to certain aspects of the talk. After all the speeches are done, the evaluators present their feedback in front of the club, covering areas such as, did the speakers use their hands to gesture well? Did they control their voices throughout the speeches? What did they do especially well, and what are some ideas for improvement? In addition to prepared speeches, a few minutes are set aside for table topics. This is often the most challenging, but also the most fun part of our meetings. During table topics, a series of questions or speaking topics are presented, and members are selected to respond on the spot. This is excellent training for those situations that come up in everyone's lives, where we have to think fast and say just the right thing. It might be a job interview, a sales meeting, or a dinner conversation. Table topics are great for practicing and honing the skills of impromptu speaking. Now that all the reports have been made, the president calls the meeting to a close. Everyone joins Toastmasters with a personal goal. Maybe it's a goal to become a more competent presenter, or learn how to run a meeting, or think faster on your feet. Whatever it is, you can achieve your goal if you participate. So, what's your goal? For more information on the club experience, please visit a Toastmasters club. To learn more about how you can become a better speaker and leader, visit www.toastmasters.org. To find a Toastmasters meeting near you, visit the Find a Club section at www.toastmasters.org.